Hello, friends. This is Brother Carlos here. We have a special uh, prayer right now. Okay, very, very special. Please pay attention. Okay, I don't do this very often. Okay, but I felt led by God this morning to do this. Okay, pay attention to details. All right. The Bible says in the book of Matthew chapter 16, verse 19, whatever you bind on earth is bound in heaven. Whatever you loose on earth is loosed in heaven. This is what I'm going to do. I'm going to bind evil spirits. I'm going to arrest evil spirits on your behalf for 30 days. Okay. All right. For 30 days. And I'm going to loose whatever these demons were hindering from coming to you, blocking whatever they were blocking from getting to you. I'm going to loose those things and they will come your way. Okay, I'm talking about financial blessings. I'm talking about money. I'm talking about extra money. I'm talking about favor uh, uh, in the marketplace. I'm talking about promotion in the job. I'm talking about an inheritance, whatever it is. Whatever evil spirits were blocking from coming to you or hindering from getting to you, for the next 30 days, they will be hindered from blocking anything. They have to let it go because they will be arrested. They will be bound. Okay. They will be incarcerated for 30 days. Can I do that? Yes, I can all day long. And I do it on my behalf all the time. Praise God. This is what I'm going to do. This is what I'm going to do right now. I'm going to ask you to sow a financial seed in order for this ministration to work for you. Why? You know, Luke 638 says, give and it shall be given to you. Basically, what we're going to do, we're going to put biblical principles to work for you and for me, for us. Okay, that's what we're going to do. And when we put bi biblical principles to work, Satan has to get out of the way. Because those are biblical principles. The Bible says, give and it shall be given to you. Good measure, pressed down, shaken together and running over. For with the measure that you measure, it will be measured back to you. Luke 6, 38. Okay. Now, <clears throat> this is what I'm going to you know, ask you to do. I'm going to give you a suggestion here. Okay. I'm going to ask you to sow at least 10 us dollars okay or more it's up to you whatever these demons were blocking from coming to you will come to you extra money favor in the marketplace a job promotion the job whatever it is okay are you ready now praise god all right let's go ahead now and arrest the evil spirits in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, the Bible says in the book of Luke, chapter 10, verse 19, I have given you authority to trample on snakes and scorpions and to overcome all the power of the enemy and not to harm you. The Bible says whatever you bind on earth is bound in heaven. Whatever you loose on earth is loosed in heaven. If you spirits, listen to me. I'm going to bind you now. I'm going to arrest you now on behalf of those who have sown financial seeds here. I'm going to arrest you and handcuff you for 30 whole days. And during this period, evil spirits, you cannot touch what belongs to these people. You cannot hinder blessings from coming to them because you are handcuffed in Jesus' mighty name. I now exercise authority over you, evil spirits, and I arrest you. I handcuff you. I confine you to prison right now for 30 whole days, beginning now in Jesus' mighty name. Beginning now in Jesus' mighty name. You are hindered from heaven, from touching anything that belongs to these people in Jesus' mighty name. 
You cannot hinder any blessing from coming to them in Jesus' mighty name. Because you are arrested, evil spirits, and you and I know that. You and I know that. And you and I know that I have authority over you, and I exercise my authority over you all the time. Right, demons? You know me, don't you? I represent Jesus Christ here. In Jesus' mighty name, you are now incarcerated for 30 days, beginning now, in Jesus' mighty name, in the lives of those who have sold at least $10 or more here in Jesus' mighty name. Can you say amen now? Can you type amen below in the comment area? Great. It's done deal. These demons cannot touch anything that belongs to you for the next 30 days. Amen. Whatever is supposed to come to you will come to you. Say amen. Father, I ask right now that you seal this deliverance and that you fill every empty spot vacated by unclean spirits with the presence of the Holy Spirit in everyone's bodies, minds, souls, and spirits. In Jesus' name, say amen. God bless you now. Bye.